Welcome in once again, Tiger fans, as we continue to look back on the road to a championship for your Fighting Tigers during the 2019 season. How many of you remember November 9th of last year? I bet you all do. Heavyweight battle in Tuscaloosa. Number one LSU, according to the AP, and number one Alabama, according to USA Today's coaches poll, a split number one versus number one matchup for the first time since 1968. Heck, even the president wanted a seat to watch this one, and it did not disappoint. LSU's defense came ready to play from the word go. A turnover and a couple of key stops, and we headed into the halftime locker room, and Alabama was in uncharted territory. They were down two scores at home. The second half would be a battle and a battle to the finish. But LSU's offense, defense, and special teams made the plays and found a way to win. Let's go back to November 9th, 2019, Bryant Denny Stadium. LSU beats Alabama. Tunga Baloa in the shotgun. Najee Harris on a wing to his right. Motion Smith at the snap. They'll fake the pitch to him. Throw out in the flat, but the pass going to be deflected. Great job by Rashard Lawrence. Big third down. Snap back to Tonga Valoa. He's going to have to run for it to the right side of the field. Lost the football. Going to be picked up by the Tigers at the nine-yard line. Big turnover by the Crimson Tide. First down, handed off Clyde edwards Lair Spins away from one tackler in the backfield. Across the 10, the 15, and very close to the first down sticks. They'll say his knee was down. Burrow in the pocket. Pressure comes. Now he'll start to run. Sidesteps a man. Gets across the 20. Far side, then forced out of bounds up near the 25. Burrow calls for the snap. Alabama trying to get to him. He's got time. Floats it out far side. Catch grab by Jamar Chase up around the 45. Eventually out of bounds. Alabama again trying to get a quick start. Burrow throws across the middle. Grab by Jefferson inside Crimson Tide territory. 16 yard on the completion. Burrow throwing. Far side and going to be grabbed by Chase at about the three. He'll step into the end zone by his lonesome. Touchdown, Tigers! Pressure comes, Burrow steps up. Burrow going to decide to run. Comes near side inside the 25 and brought down right around the 22-yard line. Placement is down. Kick is up. It has the leg and the kick is right through the uprights. Alabama showing man on the receivers as Burrow steps back. Has time, floats it out in the flat. Clyde Abergelair makes the catch on the hitch. Gets away from a defender up across the 40. Great job by Clyde Abergelair showing what he can do in the passing game. Burrow again looking to throw. Off to Jefferson. Floats it near side. Jefferson makes one man miss. Now into Crimson Tide territory. Justin Jefferson in the backfield with Burrow. He's looking to throw. Has a man wide open at the 20. Racing into the end zone. Terrace Marshall left wide open. Burrow stands tall in the pocket, fires, has a man open, caught at midfield into Bama territory. It's going to be Jamar Chase. 35-yard pitch and catch from Burrow to Chase. Burrow ready to go, but he's under duress. Slips through a couple of arm tackles, rolls to his right, drops it off at about the 34-yard line, far side to Thad Moss. Pulls from Clyde Ebergelaire, throws out into the flat, far side. Jamar Chase makes one man miss, slipped away from a tackle. Already good from 40 yards earlier. Placement is down, the kick is up. Does it have enough to get there? And it does! A 45-yard field goal for Cade York. Third down and three. Swing it back to the near side to Smith. Gonna be cut down at about the 32-yard line. This time, Caleb on Chasson. Open field tackle, got him around the shins and trips him up. Now again, gonna run, got room, 45-40, makes one man miss with a juke move, and Burrow gets up, some kind of fired up. Burrow slings it far side, and diving for it, Moss, did he hold it in? They'll say a catch down inside the one. That time picking on Trayvon Diggs. Third down goal to go from the one, Todd edwards Lair with a handoff, goes airborne, into the end zone, touchdown Tigers! Here's an interception on first down and 10, taken at the 42 yard line by Patrick Queen. Queen, down the far side hash, gonna be stood up at the 25 yard line. Burrow looking left, delivers the football, Todd edwards Lair got in the left corner, touchdown Tigers! First down, pass play, score! Snap back, here comes a blitz. Gonna drop it off, Clyde edwards Lair has it at the 35, up the near sideline, inside the 30. Gonna be very close to the first down sticks. They'll give him forward progress to the five. Picks up the first down and then some. 
First down snap. Clyde Edwards Alaire spins off a defender by his lonesome. Left corner of the end zone. Touchdown, Tigers! Shotgun snap, Burrow. Steps up in the pocket, fires. Going to be caught by Chase at the 38. Across the 40. Bounce from about the 48 into Bama territory. Down to six. Still take the snap. Burrow slings it. Wide open. Did he hold on? Jefferson did. Burrow lines him up. Here's a quick snap. Burrow keeping off the left edge with Rue inside the 20, 15, 10, slung down at the six yard line of the Alabama Crimson Tide. Snap to Burrow, hand to Clyde Edwards Hilaire, goes near side, stiff arms a man, gets to the five, breaks through, stays upright, into the end zone! Touchdown, Tigers! LSU with the football and a five point lead. Snap back, hand off Clyde Edwards Hilaire, gets through the surge and gets hit as he makes it to the 45 and then carries virtually all but three. Crimson Tide defenders inside the 40 to about the 37 yard line and picks up the first down. You think this young man from Baton Rouge doesn't want to play this game? LSU watches the final seconds roll off the clock. They've already taken the score and the clock off the facade here at Bryant-Denny Stadium. How about those Fighting Tigers? 46-41, LSU with the win, snapping Alabama's long-standing home win streak at Bryant-Denny Stadium. Tigers also would get a leg up in the SEC West on their way to an SEC title and a leg up on their way eventually for a number one seed in the college football playoff. Clyde edwards Lair, by the way, the junior running back from Baton Rouge, well, he would cement his place in LSU running back lore with the likes of Kevin Falk, Justin Vinson, Jacob Hester, Leonard Fournette, and Darius Geis. Clyde on the day would have 180 all-purpose yards, rushing for 103 and three rushing touchdowns, caught nine passes for 77 yards and a touchdown reception. Joe Burrow and his receivers were spot on and the defense was led by a tenacious group of linebackers led by Caleb on Chasson, who had a team high 11 tackles and three and a half for a loss. A memorable Saturday afternoon as LSU beat Alabama 46 to 41. We hope you've enjoyed this look back to last year's Road to a Championship, all brought to you by our team LSU partners, who remind you and yours, stay safe, stay in, and go Tigers.